Well, I haven't done a video in quite a long time there, but uh, I'd uh, sold most of my my saws off there. Kept a few of my favorites, a few I wished I wouldn't have sold, but I uh, had to uh, recoup some money. I bought me another toy, and uh, then a few weeks ago I was at the steel dealer and uh, decided they had these on sale. I got it, I think, after tax and everything, and it was like 178 bucks. Um, so I picked it up because I didn't have another, I, I, you know, I'm short a limb saw. So it's brand new. I haven't modded it or nothing, but I've uh, cut all this, which is probably on the big side for such a small saw. And then I was just using my 26 to uncut this if I stuck it or whatever. But uh, I, th I think I'm going to avoid my warranty on this. Uh, I think when I get home later tonight or whatever, I'm going to do a muffler mod and uh, a timing advance on it. And play with the carburetor a little bit but, uh, so I imagine it's gonna avoid my warranty but for 178 bucks if I can get it to pep up a little bit I, I don't care it's not like it's hard to fix them so warranty's the least of my my worries but uh, yeah we've had some wind storms I cut all this up with it today and Chopped all that up. I gotta load it, but um, I'll try to get some more videos. I'm gonna. I sold my 361 clone saw. I kind of miss it. I probably I, I got a set of case halves and I think a jug and piston and some other odds and ends. I'm probably gonna dig through my parts bin and see what I need and order me up some parts and build me another 361. I kind of miss having it. So, but I'll uh, probably do a video of that later, but uh, you guys have a good one.